On January 10th, the Canon Yearbook held their first ever theme release party. The bright and colorful visuals, combined with exciting music, caught the attention of many pirates passing by. I think it's a lot more creative than last year was, and I do think that it's going to be a lot more vibrant than the previous color scheme and everything. We spoke with the editors-in-chief of the Canon to learn more about what inspired this year's theme and what students can look forward to in the upcoming yearbook. Um, in September, we went to Elite Weekend, which is like run by our publisher. Um, it's for editors to work on our design um, and like the layout of our book. Um, so Winona and I and our assistant editor Sophia, um, we were like around a table just working on our book. I was like I had just finished like writing the first draft of the theme copy, and so I was reading it out loud to them. And then Winona was like, I got chills, <laughs> you know, because so, it was so dramatic and stuff. And then I was like, wait. <laughs> this would make a really good video. So that's how um, the, the idea of making a video came to be. Yeah. And um, the dramatic like words and stuff, it reminded me a lot of like Apple's release product launches and stuff mm -hmm. like that. So that's what I wanted to like base it off of with like like the black text on white. Everything's super simple before like the bass drop and then like everything's colorful and like it's all pink and stuff so it matches our book. I think they should look forward to hearing from their peers on a deeper level. Um, and I think we tried to incorporate some of it last year, but we're doing a lot more feature stories. There's a lot more depth and coverage, um, breadth of topics. And so I know like reading the stories isn't the most exciting part of the yearbook. Everyone wants to look at the pictures, but I would urge them to read the stories because it's really valuable information that you wouldn't have known otherwise. And it's just a good thing to look back on. And I also think this year we're trying as hard as we can not to make it look so much like a traditional yearbook. Mm -hmm. We want it to look like a very like classy like coffee table book and the spreads mimic like Wired magazine and stuff which is um, very design heavy and I don't think that's something they, they see very often so they're going to think of it as something very professional and look forward to buying it.